Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Scorpio. This is a timeless reading. Now, um, that being said, uh, whenever you view this video is when you were meant to hear its message. Let's begin. So, the current situation is over here. We have the Knight of Pentacles reverse with this Three of Swords, so this is the situation here. A plan failed. It didn't work. Okay, and so this could have been a culmination of meetings, um, being unable to agree, um, somebody's emotions or gossip or bad advice could have uh, been uh, the interfering element here for someone. Um, yeah, something going round and round, never finding a solution, um, and the plan failed. Now, it could have been a plan to uh, reconcile um, with someone to move forward um, to change the status of a relationship in some way. And this could have been even like um, the same old argument. Um, so looking over here, somebody was thinking very negative. Yeah, this was about a second chance, possibly that that didn't uh, that didn't work. Somebody was holding back information. Judgments in the reverse. Uh, so something went into suspension, uh, possibly because of somebody's negative thinking. Somebody may have felt threatened, didn't really know which foot to stand on. Um, Three of Swords energy, but it is the negative aspect of the Three of Swords. Um, somebody may have felt disillusioned. Um, there could have been a misunderstanding. Somebody could have been missing information because one was holding back information. Um, hmm. There was confusion. Um, Somebody was confused about giving this a second chance or another chance or confused about what was laid out before them, about what was being shown to them. And so judgment, you know, it's about uh, lessons, uh, forgiveness. Um, if the lessons, because I have other cards pertaining to something having not been learned, if it is not uh, or does is not seen or learned, there can be trouble ahead here. You see. Moving forward, um, uh, what should be considered, what action should be taken? Well, there should be a pause and a reflect period here. Uh, on, this, on this ending and how it transpired, what was at the root of it? Um... It could be about how you were manifesting it with the magician. Um, yeah, your ability to manifest will be enhanced at this time. So, possibly things that once appeared to be difficult. Um, may uh, 
may seem a little easier in the future here, as long as you respect the power that is, meaning that your intentions are for the good of all with harm to none. I feel that the reasons why the manifestation wasn't working or didn't work or the plan failed, there was a deeper emotion uh, um, that was the issue or that was at play here and that would need pause and reflect. Uh, um, you would need to, you or them, to reflect on exactly what was that. There was something, some hidden emotion here is what this card uh, was talking about. This this can also be a card of somebody who might just be thinking of themselves, um, maybe did not take into consideration uh, the other person's feelings when it came to, uh, to the plan. Judgment um, in the reverse is about learning from your mistakes and breaking patterns that have brought you down. This is going to be the most important action uh, that you will foster, you or them, uh, within yourself at this time. And this is what um, is needed at this time. There's a deeper emotional issue. Um, it could be a pattern. Okay, this may not be the first time the plan has failed. It could be that there's something that you've been avoiding or putting off or ignoring. And this comes from the deepest part of you, something you've buried or that they have. It's, it's, it's an emotion. Or it, it's something that makes one very emotional and rather than deal with it, they just tuck it away or hide it, bury it. It's something that has been ignored and avoided and put off. But uh, now, um, now it is, uh, it is time to deal with it, basically, so that you don't have to repeat the lesson again. You or them. And you will be given the chance, judgment here is in the upright, in how things are going to develop. So, um, with regards to working with someone, um, it didn't work because maybe you were not understanding, uh, not cooperating. There is you or them. Um, there is another chance, another uh, opportunity coming in. Um, there is some luck or good luck here. There's a new offer. Somebody is thinking about it. There was a deeper emotional issue that caused the plan to fail. You see, it's repeating here again um, that somebody is reflecting upon and that needs to be dealt with or is currently being dealt with. Um, it's like this person, when they come out of this state, when they come out of this state, um, it's like they are reborn. Yeah, and, and that makes sense with judgment and with the child. Because whatever this is goes way back and something that they have avoided uh, looking at. And so we know there is a new opportunity. The wheel of fortune is here. 
there's a new opportunity for this commitment that did not work. Clarity is coming. Okay? Uh, from, see, the Four of Swords. Same energy here. Clarity is coming. This is overcoming difficulties. Getting to the root of the issues. This is... Um, it's almost like, so the wheel is here waiting to see if the lesson has been learned. Because it is about uh, the lessons, uh, luck, karma, opportunity. The wheel says it's time to evolve, to change and transform yourself or them. Okay. So, uh, either you will either, uh, you either have or will experience either victory or defeat, depending if you've learned the lesson. So what it tells you is, um, that you need to look for whatever generated, um, the victory or the defeat, whatever, whatever it was you had back here, and you had definitely had a defeat, you need to look at what generated it. So you don't have to repeat this lesson in the future is what it's saying. And that's what all these other cards are saying for either you or them, whoever this energy belongs to. There's something much deeper that needs to be looked at so that uh, you can learn from it so that you don't have to repeat this energy in the future. And so, a new opportunity is brought around and a new offer after this has happened. And hopefully, they have learned the lesson. And only time will tell. You see, let's start here. A text message you will get if this comes, if this is the other person's energy. A social media request, okay? I'm coming back. I didn't love myself. This tells me that they really did see because there's a reason, an experience, an emotional issue that caused that to happen. Something happened to that person in the past that made them feel like that. and they found it. So now they can change things and that's what they're doing. And there's an understanding here that I really do need you. So you see, that's where the problem was. How can you love somebody else if you don't love yourself? I want to help heal your heart you are a blessing in my life. So um, they understand the pain that they have caused you and they want to help heal your heart. And it's like in the same breath, it's like they're, they're healing you, but they're also healing themselves. Messages from the divine. The divine has your back. It's always there, guiding, supporting, whispering. Abundance and stability are entering your life now. This is a soulmate, but 
it's also a lesson. I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who uh, who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.